What's up, gang? Hope everyone's having an awesome day, whatever day it is for you when you're watching this. Welcome to the long-awaited Wendy's Frosty video. It's been 84 years. So this started because I love chocolate milkshakes. Damn, it's a good milkshake. I love Wendy's Frosties. One day, I was craving a chocolate, I don't know, ice cream, milkshake, some kind of shenanigan like that. And I thought, okay, well, I have frozen banana. I have, you know, this and that. I'm gonna check it all in the blender and just see what happens. And oh my goodness, tasted just like a Wendy's Frosty. Bloody delicious. Now, if you are not of the optimal healthy variety like myself, and you enjoy taking more liberties with your diet like I do sometimes, I've got you to. You know, you don't have to have the most optimally healthy version. I just like to because why not? If you can make it taste good and it loves your body more, boom. That is how we win. That's where you lose weight. That's where you keep your healthy weight and keep at your goals effortlessly. At least it's become effortless for me over the past few years. Many. However, let's go and make this frosty and at the end I'm going to show you how to make the less healthy version. However, this is delicious. Let's go. We have have a frozen banana, some vegan greens plus, cause you know, we could always use more veggies. Three packets of stevia. This is cacao powder. This is psyllium husk powder for fiber. Some ice, unsweetened vanilla creamy cashew milk, and maple syrup to sweeten. We're gonna throw all of that in this Breville Boss. It is incredible. And that is going to create a mock Wendy's Frosty. I'm telling ya, it's gonna be delicious. Also, it doesn't have much to do with health and fitness, but I've been asked to make a video on how I repurpose these Bath and Body Works containers. And you know, it can have a little bit to do with health because it is way healthier to store any kind of food items in glass other than plastic. Not to mention, these have little rubber things on the lid, so it creates a nice seal that way. It's a piece of cake. You're saving money to spend on more healthy food. See what I did there? Yeah, so that video is gonna come down the line too. I totally forgot to mention that adding protein is an awesome idea. This one is unflavored. I recommend chocolate for the frosty idea, obviously. And then if I'm feeling really cheeky, sugar-free, calorie-free, not good for you, not healthy. But part of my 80-20, if I really feel like making that sweet, I will put some of this in here. Anyhow, let's get this blended. Now the Breville Boss, why I recommend this is because you need to have a Vitamix or stronger blender if you're using any kind of greens powder in order to make it bioavailable to your gut or a protein powder. So bioavailability means that your gut can properly absorb it because it has been assimilated into small enough powder essentially so that your gut can absorb it. All right, I love this because it's got the green smoothie option. You can literally put spinach in here, it disappears, won't even know it's there. It's got the smoothie frozen dessert. I'm gonna try that. And everything takes exactly one minute, also BPA free. BPA is dangerous because it mimics hormones in the body leading to endocrine disruption, which can be detrimental, especially to children during early developmental stages. It has been linked to heart disease, cancer, obesity, infertility, autism, and more. Yum. Oh yeah, I put one tablespoon of cacao powder and one teaspoon of the psyllium husk fiber. Also that psyllium husk fiber thickens it. So, oh, and one cup of almond milk. Delicious. That's it. Because I promised, here is the unhealthy Wendy's Frosty actual ingredients that probably taste a lot more like a Wendy's Frosty than my healthy version, but not good for you. Anyhow, one can of sweetened condensed milk, one eight ounce tub of Cool Whip, a half gallon of chocolate milk. Mix all of the ingredients first, then pour them into an ice cream maker. Mix for 20 to 30 minutes until it reaches frozen perfection. Pour in a big glass, insert straw, and enjoy. And then there's also a low calorie version. One cup of fat free milk, two tablespoons of low calorie or sugar free chocolate instant pudding, two tablespoons of Cool Whip. It says free there. I'm not sure if it means fat free Cool Whip. One teaspoon of vanilla and eight ice cubes. Put all of those ingredients in a blender and blend until smooth. So, whichever way you roll, enjoy. That's it. Super easy. So healthy for you. And like I say, add in the protein if you want to make it more of a meal. Add in a handful of baby 
baby spinach. Add in some avocado, it makes it way creamier. You know, watch out on the spinach front though, because although it does disappear in a blender such as this Boss, it's still not gonna taste as good and as treat-like as if you just leave out the veggies for this one, okay? Anyhow, if you thought this video was helpful, informative, or entertaining at all, please hit that thumbs up down there, as that lets me know what kind of content to keep producing for you. If you have any ideas of any recipes you want me to hack or you would like to see hacked, please do comment them below, because I have not been stumped yet. And if you would like notifications of each time I post a new video, please hit that little bell notification icon down there, and you will be notified each time I upload. Please, please subscribe to this channel. Subscribing really is where all of the support comes from for me. Please share the channel. Aside from silly recipe videos like this, there are videos on this channel that can help heal more than 90% of any health, wellness, or body image challenge, including weight loss, folks. It's really not that hard. I've got the secrets. Check them down below. And until next time, have super amounts of fun in your life. Have super amounts of fun trying to hack recipes yourself. If you do one, send it to me. Let me know. I want to try it. I'm all about sharing the ideas. And until next time, I'll see you then. Bye.